Cortex is the productivity stack. This is the stack you want to take for total mental energy, total mental dominance, total motivation, verbal fluency, focus, and the drive to get work done. Get the Cortex Nootropic stack at livecortex.com. Feel what it feels like to fire on all cylinders. What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Ryan, and I'm here to give you information about nootropics. As per usual, so in this video, we're going to talk about uh, basically trying to reverse some of the tolerance that you get from caffeine, uh, particularly when drinking caffeine later in the day. Because I think, you know, if folks develop a tolerance for caffeine, it's not affecting them the way that they want it to. It still works pretty well in the morning, right? right? It still works pretty well at at least waking you up and turning your brain on and getting you primed to do work in the morning. It's, it's, it's only in the later hours, 2, 3 p.m., when you're on your second or third cup of coffee that people tend to run into a problem with it, right? They tend to be like, they tend to drink their coffee and it just doesn't wake them up like it used to. It doesn't drive them into the evening with productivity like it used to, and there's a way around that, and it is basically to take a nootropic compound with it, a very particular nootropic compound that interacts with the adenosine receptors and the adenosine signaling in an interesting way uh, with caffeine, which amplifies the effects of the stimulant caffeine. So we're gonna get to that in just a second, but first, a minute and a half of product, let's direct people to the website, because it's got awesome stuff. Number one, livecortex.com, that's our website, livecortex.com slash blog, giant blog about nootropics, just everything you can think of from dose ranges to experiences with certain nootropics to directions, livecortex.com slash blog. Also on the uh, Cortex Labs website, we've got the Cortex Labs nootropics podcast. You can find that on iTunes too. 48 episodes of just all nootropics information, many more coming. The thing is packed with doses, information, anecdotal experiences, instructions, and more around nootropics. And then we've got basically five products right now. Number one, the Cortex stack. Uh, if you really want a stack that that heightens cognitive function in every way imaginable, get the Cortex stack. You know, we, we give this, and people that buy this are are everybody that you can think of. But a, a large bit of our customers are like high level business folks that require eighteen hours a day of executive functioning. They use Cortex for that. Uh, number two, we wrote a digital stack list. We wrote th four digital stack lists. Uh, the first one is called Nootropic Sex for the Business Professional. These are very high level phenylporacetam, uridine, oxyracetam, alcar, theocrine, and aniracetam stacks. It's digital, so get it at livecortex.com. About 100 stacks there. Two, we wrote one called the Nupep Pro Stack List, which breaks down all of the, uh, a, a large quantity of Nupep stacks. There's about 40 or 50 of them. They are high level, complex, highly effective Nupep nootropic stacks. Uh, three, we wrote one called the Racetam God Guide, which is 80 or so Racetam nootropic stacks, just laid out with the directions, what they do to you, etc. And then four, if you're new, brand new to nootropics, we wrote a guide called Smarter, Better, Faster, which is essentially the, the modern age of uh, smart drugs and whatever, I forget what that book is called, but it's like the modern digital guide on, on nootropics. It gives you everything. Get all that stuff at livecortex.com. Okay, so uh, so, Basically, getting right to the answer of how to reverse tolerance on caffeine, or how to—I uh, want to say reverse because that's that's probably not entirely possible—but how to uh, amplify the effects of caffeine and truly make a mark on your tolerance for caffeine. The answer, just getting right to the answer, is to take it with uridine monophosphate. The anecdotal is the following: uh, uridine amplifies stimulants. Number one, this goes all the way back years and years and years ago to the famous longevity thread. It's a 94-page thread. Like you don't have to read all 94 pages. I did. It's pretty awesome. But you could read the first couple pages and then skim through some of the rest of the pages to get an idea of it. Where it basically talks about uh, the Mr. Happy Stack, which is uridine, DHA, a choline source, B vitamins, you know, and some minerals. It was actually the basis for a lot of the research that the guy who started that thread, uh, it was sort of the basis for formulating the Cortex stack. I took some of that information and formulated it in, into a stack I was taking myself, which turned my brain on, you know, something crazy, and then eventually that became the Cortex stack. Well, in that, they talk about uh, uridine particularly, and one of the caveats that the author of the thread gives to people is say, he says, Look, if, if you're going to take uridine, watch out because it amplifies other stimulants. And then they actually give a paper uh, which explains some of the complex mechanisms of uridine's interaction with the same receptor sites that caffeine works on. 
if you really want to try to interpret it, which I, I, I even I am having a difficult time interpreting, I think I understand what it says. Uh, you know, a short version of it is uh, called interactions of nucleoside analogs, caffeine and nicotine with human concentrative nucleoside transporters one and two. Uh, just Google, just Google that and 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 read it. I say I think the. Uh, the significant part of it is the results indicated that although HCNT1 and HCNT2 possess some overlap in transport of several uridine and adenosine analogs, they also exhibit distinct differences in capacity to interact with some adenosine receptor ligands, adenosine-based drugs, and nicotine. So what, what, what I think this study is saying and what the, the overall contention of the person who suggested, who initially brought the uridine choline uh, DHA, B vitamin stack, to the forefront years and years and years ago, uh, is basically that uridine amplifies stimulants and that uridine interacts with the same neurotransmitter receptor sites as caffeine does in a way that amplifies it and modulates the tolerance. Okay, so you can actually, as far as I can tell, you could literally modulate your tolerance to caffeine by taking uridine with it. Here's the instructions. 50, okay, 50 to 150 milligrams of uridine 10 minutes before you drink your caffeine because uridine onsets very, very quickly. That's why when folks take our Cortex stack, like it onsets within 10, 20 minutes. They're like, holy crap, I've never seen anything like this. This is insane. And that's because uridine, you know, it's CDP coin and artichoke extract helping it too within Cortex, but uridine is just like, shh, 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 shh. it just amplifies brain performance pretty regularly. It'll make you silly productive. <laughs> and so um, the difference in the dose will really depend on you. So you'll have to experiment. And it seems to be the case that the longer you've taken uridine, the less you need it when you're taking it with caffeine in order to amplify the effects of caffeine. So I've been taking uridine on and off for like six years or something. And so these days I take 25 to 50 milligrams of uridine 10 minutes before coffee and it's just like, Whoosh, rocket fuel and I just like to, I don't even want I don't even want to pet my cat like I just don't want to do anything but work you know that's what it does and so but if you've never taken uridine before maybe you'll need 100 to 150 milligrams you're gonna to have to experiment if there was a sweet spot to start off with I'd say start with 75 75 milligrams of, of uridine 10 minutes before you drink your caffeine uh, and you could do this in the morning too. You could do it right when you wake up and, 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 and it'll definitely amplify your morning stack. <laughs> I mean, your morning coffee, you, you will be bouncing off of walls, but uh, truly the best thing to do is if you're running into a tolerance later on in the day where you're drinking coffee and it's not affecting you the way that it normally does, you know, take 50 to 150 milligrams of uridine monophosphate 10 or so minutes before your coffee and you tell me if that doesn't amplify it. Okay, we've got papers that say there's interaction between the neurotransmitter receptor sites. There's anecdotals all over the web that this works quite well. It works remarkably well for me and people have suggested it too. Uh, that's actually why on the back of the Cortex uh, bottle we actually say stacks well with B vitamins, DHA, and caffeine. It is because of this mechanism of uridine and caffeine. So that's about as close as you're going to get to uh, reversing tolerance or working on tolerance with caffeine to make caffeine still work really, really well throughout the day. Just add uridine. You will thank me. Thanks for watching. What's up, everybody? Thanks so much for watching. Ryan Michael Ballow here. Okay, I'm going to break down real quick for you our top five elite level nootropic products. Number one, starting from the left, because we got to start from the left. The Cortex Nootropic Stack, that's basically a stack that turns the lights on. It's an everything stack. Some stacks are working for verbal fluency, motivation, mental energy, speed of processing. Cortex is everything. Just to give you an idea, I was running a company 18 hours a day when I was taking that stack. And then I formulated it into a pre-made stack. Very powerful for speed of processing mental energy, motivation, and the drive to get work done. Uh, secondly, that guide, that's a digital guide next to Cortex. It's called Nootropic Stacks for the Business Professional. A hundred powerful stacks oriented specifically toward productivity and the kind of brain states you need to be a beast in being productive. Moving right along, the Racetam God Guide. That is a list of about 80 stacks of all the major racetams, all the powerful racetams we normally talk about. Anoracetam, phenylparacetam, oxiracetam, coloracetam, fasoracetam, and more. It lays out complex high-level stacks with all of those uh, racetams. Then moving on to the new Pept Pro Stack List. The new Pept Pro Stack List is a giant list of oral, sublingual, and nasal spray new Pept stacks. I mean, if you want high-level nootropic stacks, high-level new Pept stacks that are brain state specific, 
download that digital guide. And then lastly, there's Smarter, Better, Faster. Smarter, Better, Faster is the all-around general sort of everything nootropics digital guide. Teaches you everything. Teaches you racetams, teaches you choline sources, teaches you modafinil, gives you very many stacks, shows you how to cycle. Very powerful digital guide. All of these guides are digital, so they're downloadable on a Mac, a PC, an iPhone, an iPad, an Android, an Android tablet, Kindle, Anything you can think of, and there's also PDF versions of all of them available, get them all at livecortex.com. Download those guides. You'll have them instantly. They are very powerful. And hey, if you really want a pre-made stack that turns on the lights that people from all around the world in different disciplines use to crank up brain performance, get a bottle of the Cortex stack. Thanks so much for being with me. Livecortex.com to get these elite-level nootropic products and rock on.